Yeah, this is a lot. I mean, it's going to be a time where everybody says it's our last game and want our last game to be the national championship, so we know we got to work to get there. Now, that's a great goal to have, but you also have kept in mind you got to go to keep series by series, play by play. One day at a time. One day at a time. Congratulations on a great career up from that. This should be a special year for you. I appreciate it. Good luck. Thank you. Trey, what's going on, man? How you doing? How's, uh, how's Ramon looked at, at safety opposite of you? And, uh, what's your impression of him in, in fall camp? I think he's been great. You know, he's, uh, he's made plays every day. Um, he's getting better every day. And, uh, I know he'll be fine. Yeah. Is it a new mentality that you're trying to help teach him, or is it kind of the same transition from cornerback to safety? Uh, I mean, it's a little different. I told him you got to be a little bit more physical. And since the first day, he, since the first day I told him, he's he's like he's been the bullet, so he's he's doing everything he can. Yeah. The mentality, I guess, last year was kind of the, we're taking it back. Uh -huh. What's you guys' mentality as a defense this year going into 2016? Uh, Coach Spencer has a, a quote from Pulp Fiction that I haven't yet summarized. You memorized it? I haven't remembered. Okay. It. Yeah, I'm so sorry, <laughs> but. I know it's something about being violent and taking care of the ball, so it's something we got to pride ourselves on doing. Coach Gundy has talked a lot about just how quick your guys' defense is. What do you think that's attributed to? Is it like communication, you know, kind of knowing what you guys are doing now? I, I think it's a little bit of everything. Um, we actually talk about how athletic we are every day. So uh, everybody's out there trying to show it every chance they get. It takes it's a, it's a great thing to be a part of. Do you think people would have been surprised by what they saw from the defense and the uh, Surprised, maybe, because the offense is so great that we have here. And, uh, we just pride ourselves on trying to be the best just like them. So, um, yeah, I, I think they would be. Do you think the defense has a little bit of a chip on it? Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, defense, you got to have a chip on your shoulder, especially in this league. It's all such an offensive league, such an offensive league, like I said. So, yeah, we always got to work with a chip on our shoulder, and we want to be the best. What specifically strikes you about Jason's offense? Uh, they, I, did, I see Baylor. I know the Baylor coaches came from over there, and uh, that's exactly what I see. They have a great running back. They got a young quarterback this year, but I know their receivers can make plays, too. So staying assignment sound focused, how, what's that going to take from this? Uh, it's just going to not looking forward. We just got to go and play at a time, one day at a time. And that's one thing we got to pride ourselves on doing. Compared to other seasons, how are you feeling differently at this point than maybe you might have? Um, I always talk about my confidence. I feel like I'm I feel like I'm the best I can be right now. I left it out there on the field for practice and just ready to play. And uh, Mayweather or McGregor? Uh, I can't really answer. Okay. I, I, don't, I, don't, <laughs> I can't answer. I can't answer. <laughs> I really want a good fight. That's all I want. I want a good fight. Hopefully somebody gets knocked out. That'll be the end of my night. But yeah, that, I, I just want a good one. <laughs> so you don't have money on either team? Oh, no. I've right. been Dyson said we can't get one. <laughs> Has the new practice format allowed you guys to kind of stay fresh as, as fall camp rolls around in the middle of the season? Oh, yeah. um, Coach Lass and Coach Gundy have yeah. um, had a, the best plan that they got. And um, we just execute as much as we can. We just listen. Yeah. Have you taken a new approach to this year being your last year? And, and what type of approach, maybe off the field, that you feel like may help you in 2017? Uh, well, I graduated, so I got a lot more free time. You know, I, I try to pride myself on watching film, just take care of my body as much as I can. Um, I talk to some people in the league. That's what they do, so that's one thing I want to do. Yeah. Have you talked to Jordan Stearns or Ashton Lampkin about their experience in the NFL? And... Oh, yeah, they, uh, they actually text me, surprisingly. Right. I always thought I was going to have to call them or something, yeah. but they text me and check up on me. And, we're still friends, and it's a brotherhood, and they, they talk about it a lot, you know, it's, um, it sounds great. <laughs> what advice have they given you just uh, preparing, obviously, you want to play in the NFL, which... Oh, yeah, just, um, I mean, they tell me everything they used to tell me before the game, you know, just go day by day, you know, don't stress up the little things, and go have fun, that's yeah. what it's all about. Thanks, Jeff. Thank you. Appreciate it.